We're out here on the shore of the Great Salt Lake, next to the salt air. Redocumenting these historic markers because they were just moved over here. They were on a freeway rest stop over here that got shut down. So they moved them over here. Daughters of Utah Pioneers markers 115 and 118. And a California Trail marker. 118 had been replaced back in 2015. That's why that plaque looks different than that one. I have an old picture where it used to look more similar. Here's that picture now. And here are pictures of these before they got moved. So 115 talks about the Garfield and Lake Point resorts. It says from 1881 to 1893, Garfield Beach was the most famous and finest recreation resort on the shores of the Great Salt Lake with its railroad station, lunch stand, restaurant, bathhouses, and pier leading to the dance pavilion. And with the pioneer steamboat, City of Corinne exhibited at anchor. Lake Point was located a mile and a half west. Three-story hotel erected there by Dr. Peter Clinton became a stopping place for overland stages. The boulder used for this shaft was taken from Old Buffalo Ranch, one half mile west. And over here we've got Pioneer Black Rock Resort. On July 27, 1847, an exploring party of pioneers bathed near historic Black Rock. In 1851, the first recorded 4th of July celebration was held here. 150 vehicles and 60 horsemen arrived from Salt Lake City. A huge homemade flag was unfurled. In about 1860, a rock home was erected where guests were entertained. In 1880, Alonzo Hyde and David Taylor erected 100 bathhouses, a bowery, a boardwalk, and other amenities. Steamboats sailing the lake were an attraction. And these markers are kind of cool. They have excerpts from journals from the California Trail. This one is Jedediah Smith's Trail, Great Salt Lake. Coming to the point of the ridge, I saw an expanse of water extending far to the north and east. The Salt Lake, a joyful sight, was spread before us. I had traveled so much in the vicinity of the Salt Lake that it had become my home in the wilderness. After coming in view of the lake, I traveled east and found a spring of fresh water and encamped. Jedediah Smith, June of 1827.